Hi, it's MD Ravi Sunny. Today we are going to upload or publish an active e-commerce Flutter application to the Google Play Console. I have already uploaded the application and it's on Google Play Store right now. I can show you. Let me show you. Just uh, I have to search in Google Play Store. Here, 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 here is Play Store. Play Store and if I search Sailbus, also you can search it, Sailbus. And it's on Google Play Store. And here is our application and install. I can install it and open it. Okay, so it's installed done. Now just open it. And here you can see our fast interface and it's running smoothly. Also, if you want to click on any product here, you can see the product and also you can purchase or buy now. Okay, so let's just upload this application on Google Play Store. Actually, I have recorded it when I was uploading this on Google Play Store and you will uh, see right now how I have uploaded and how it was approved. It, it is actually approved right now, okay? So right now, we can just start upload, okay? So here is our all file, uh, graphic picture, this one, and application AAB file, app logo, and all other app screenshot, okay? So, I'm right on, chole jabo, Google Play Console. Google Play Console search. Google Play Console. Go to Play Console. Privacy policy. Privacy policy actually website er ekdom niche. Amader jo website ta thakbe, wo website er ekhane privacy policy thakbe. Eita. To ei holo privacy policy link ta eita amra copy korbo just copy kore amra eita ke diye diye ekhane. Content, app content again and start declaration. No, my app doesn't show any kind of ads. App content again. App access. Kiki donor access nai. Though I can state a holoje. All some functionality in my okay. So some functionality will tama the login detail taken a at Kuraditobe and instruction name. Uh, login as a login the login username holo l3ttmind.com at the rate gmail.com rubi ios ios 140 at the rate this one and at You can log in with this user name and password to test app. I am basic, just basic, basic click the hobby. I'm other app tag upload the original. Uh, J to me to log in Kore, Dick the paro, having app tag test court the paro. I am filling. Okay. 
sick app content again start declaration start questionary okay so you can add the email address so here is email and this one is actually all other type of apps because it's a shopping apps here you can see product consumer stores and next and everything is no here because they will ask for sexual violence or like any offensive language something like that so just no is restricted no again just click on app content or here also you can click app content app content another declaration 13 16 18 over yes this one next save app content start declaration this one is new set no not for covid 19 update app content again start declaration so right now we are inside data safety and click next then select yes then select yes again uh, encrypted in transist our data is encrypted yes and scroll down and uh, tick mark on username and password we collect it and scroll down you have to provide a delete url link delete url link i mean when any kind of customer want to delete their data they will send you a email or contact with you for that you have to give a contact uh, uh, link uh, so if you visit here you will see uh, contact details you will see contact details sell bus and contact number so if user want to delete their data they can contact with us and scroll down uh, select no there is no uh, data is deleted automatically things so you just have to select here no and then click on next click on next then what do you collect i mean in our application we collect like name email address uh, address phone number sometime yeah that's all we collect financial info messages and uh, and other information we actually don't collect but device other id maybe we collect yeah we do we do so next start collect uh, data is transferred to third party. No, we don't actually transfer it to third party. So just yes, yes. App functionality analytics. Click on it. Collect. Yes, yes. App functionality analytics. Save. And click on it. Collect. Share. Yes data collection app functionality analytics app functionality analytics i think i have clicked on shared okay now good save phone number phone number collect yes this collect yes app functionality and analytics okay save device and other ide Collect yes, app functionality analytics save no device and other IDE also for apps such as showing recommended content, for example, suggesting playlist. No, 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 okay, everything good now. Click on save the app content and start declaration and yes does your app use advertising id yes 
app functionality app analytics for that yeah simple it is nothing more okay now click on app content again and start declaration and now is this a government apps if yes then yes if no then no our app is not for government okay and app content again start declaration and all we have to do is just app doesn't provide any financial feature this one because uh, we are not cryptocurrency or any gambling type or any payment system application so just click on next and save app content okay so all clear in the app content setting also it is the same place uh, here 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 you can see we have completed all the step okay so uh, okay okay we have left two steps so we have to click on it and fulfill it so let's submit the app category app category is actually shopping app this one shopping app save name is tag name is tag is shopping app okay shopping app not brutal shop shopping just shopping app email address website we have our website like https sellbuzz.com uh, sellbuzz.com and email address is sellbuzzshop okay Okay, so email it is complete. Now click on one and one. Good. And now click on dashboard again. Set up your e store listening here. Here we will see and we can up uh, i mean submit app icon here so it is the same icon that we have used in our application so sell bus click on it and sell bus open it and feature graphic picture this one is feature graphics picture icon is complete here you can see here and phone screenshot also so all the phone screenshot we can put it together okay let's let's just do it upload more upload this one also okay let's just make this one first yeah done so our feature graphics done app logo done now short description so full description of your app can't be the short okay now app name short description full description app icon feature graphic video no need to upload video right now 
phone screenshot later you can upload them and no need to upload tablet or 10 inch tablet screenshot uh, if you want you can upload it yeah but uh, these are the thing is actually required or mandatory you can say save okay all done so right now we just have to upload the application uh, for upload application we have to click here production in the production option now in the production first of all we have to select country region here and add country all of the country okay save it and uh, release you can click here also we can click here okay and create new release and choose sign in key use google generated key first this one okay and next we just upload it so click on upload button app release aab file this one is on the syllabus app file that i have copy already okay also we have to put the release notes here we can actually use our same as like short description this one same description we used paste okay app upload done so it is the app version and click on next if there is any red warning that's mean we have to solve but two yellow warning can be normal okay so one yellow warning it's normal and if there is red warning we have to solve it uh, like update declaration click on it and we have to click on the this accept button okay I understand information okay now again click on the production button and click on edit release and now go to the next and now we'll see show it will show you us like two warning update declaration your advertising declaration control doesn't okay to so let's just do it like advertising declaration now click on production again edit release and click on next it will see okay actually we will not use any kind of advertising in our application so there is no need to use it as it is just save it because there is no need advertising uh, ID in our application because we will not use any kind of admog ads so click on dashboard click on it and click on next to go to publishing overview same 14 changes for review okay here all done all done now so it's in review after two or three days it will automatically publish in the play store yeah that's all if you like this video please subscribe this youtube channel i will upload more tutorial for you